Did you guys know that 95 squared is 9025? And did you guys also know that you can you can do that do it that quick? Okay. I will show you how to do it. All right. First we do the 5 squared. 5 squared is 25, so we put the 25 right over here. And then next we're going to going to see what we're going to do with the number 9. With number 9, we're going to times it um, by the next highest number, which is 10 in this case. So we're going to do 9 times 10, which is going to be 90. So we're going to write the 90 down. And as a result, the answer is going to be 9,025. OK, let's try some questions. All right, 35 squared. Let's do 35 squared first. OK, with 35 squared, we're going to do the same thing again. We're going to do 5 squared first. It's going to be 25. And then we're going to do, and then we're going to times the 3 by the next highest number, which is going to be 4. So 3 times 4 is going to be 12. So the answer is 1,225. That's for 35 squared. OK, let's look at even smaller numbers if you guys haven't just understood it yet. OK, let's start with 15 squared. OK, with 15 squared, we can see that 5 times 5 is 25. And we're going to times 1 by its next highest number, which is obviously 2. So we're going to put the 2 down. It's going to be 225. OK, and so the answer is going to be 225, 225. All right, now let's try some let's try some questions now. So I'm going to you guys can pause the video now if you guys are feeling confident enough and you guys can answer the question with me and then play the video again once you guys are ready. OK, let's go with 25 squared now. OK. Again, we're going to do the same thing. With 25 squared, we're going to do 5 times 5, which is going to be 25. And then we're going to do, we're going to times 2 by its next highest number, which is obviously going to be 3. So it's going to be 2 times 3, which is going to be 6. So the answer is going to be 625. OK, I hope you guys got that one right. Let's go to the next one, which is going, obviously going to be 45 squared. OK, 45 squared, same thing again. 5 times 5, 25. And then we're going to times 4 by its um, next highest number, which is obviously 5. So we're going to get 20. So 4 times 5 is 20. And we're going to write that 20 down. So the answer is 2,025. OK. Let's try some harder questions now. Let's go on a bit of a harder questions. OK, let's try 65 squared now. OK, so we're going to do the same thing again. So 5 squared is going to be 25. And then we're going to do um, times 6 by its um, next highest number, which is obviously 7. So we're going to get 6 times 7, which is going to be 42. So the answer is going to be 4,225. All right. I think you guys are now ready to go into harder questions. So let's go on even harder questions now. Let's go into three-digit numbers now. Let's go to 115. Let's go big on this question. OK, I'll show you guys how to do this one. And then I'll, guys, I'll give you guys um, another question for you guys to try. OK, with 115 squared, we're going to do the same thing again. 5 squared, which is going to be 25, obviously. And then 11, this time we're going to times by its highest number, which is obviously going to be 12. So 11 times 12 is 132. We're going to write that 132 straight, straight away downwards. And so the answer is going to be um, 13,225. Okay, so we're going to do the same for this question now. So, so again, we're going to do 5 squared, which is obviously going to be 25. Let's write that 25 down. And then now we got to do 19 times um, its next highest number, which is um, 20. 
So we're going to do 19 times 20. To make this question a little bit easier, let's do 19 times 2, which is 38. And then let's times that by 10, which is 380 to make it a bit easier for you guys. OK, so that gives us an answer of 38,025. OK, guys, so now we're going to try out 225 squared. OK, this question, we're going to do the same thing, same thing again which is going to be 5 squared, which is going to be 25. And then now we're going to times um, 22 by its next um, highest number, which is going to be 23. So we're going to do 23 times 22. OK, the point of this trick was to do it in our head. Since we can't do it in our head and we have to work it out on a notebook, um, so that's what we have to do now in this question. So we are going to do um, I hope you enjoyed this video 22. and found this video long useful. multiplication. Um, which is going to be three times two. If you find this video six, useful, give this video a thumbs up, which is four, and share it with and your then friends. And again, three times two I'll is see six. See you guys in my and next video. Thanks for watching. Is four. Okay, now we're going to add these up. Um, so we're going to so we're going to put the six down. We're going to add the f um, four plus six, which is going to be ten. Get the remainder over to the other side. Four plus one is five. Okay. So we got 506 now, so let's write 506 right here. So the answer for this question, which is 225 squared, is 50,625. Okay, as I said, the point of this trick was to do it in our head. Since we can't do it in our head, I've got another video and I've got another trick um, to do um, numbers like, to multiply numbers like 23 times 22, you know, so I've got another trick. So I will see you guys in my next video.